Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is Caitlin here. Today I'm doing a video which was kind of a trend maybe two or three months ago, but I finally got around to doing it because it looked a lot of fun. I actually filmed this video down when I was in London, but because it's a collaboration, it's taken a little bit of time to coordinate and get it up. So I'm finally getting around and able to show you guys this video, which I'm super excited to do. So this video, as I've already mentioned, is a collaboration. It is with my good friend Karis here on YouTube. Her channel is or was Galaxy of Fashion, but I think she's changed it and gone with her name now. She does a lot of fashion, uni, vegan related videos. She is so sweet and so lovely and she came on board and did this video with me. And then also we have a third person for this collaboration who was the photographer. His name is James Westlake. He is an amazing photographer, super talented, does a whole range of stuff, but he very, very kindly came along to our filming day and took all the photos for us, which made them even cooler. So yeah. Check them both out, both their Instagram handles and Karis's YouTube channel will be linked down there because you should obviously watch her video as well to see her photos. I haven't actually said what this video is, oh my gosh. So today I'm doing the ugly location photo shoot challenge. So I think I went to around six locations in total. I had four different outfits because I wanted them to kind of fit each location and be a little bit different for you guys and more interesting. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what happened and what the locations looked like, what all went down, because to be fair, and you know, not gonna brag, even though it wasn't really my effort, it was more James's, the photographer, but I think they turned out pretty cool. I hope you enjoy this video, please leave a thumbs up if you did enjoy it, subscribe to myself but also Karis and obviously check out James's Instagram and I will get on to the video. Let's go! So the first location which we went to was this courtyard area, it was pretty run down, there was a bunch of cones everywhere, there was also kids playing like basketball nearby, so that was location one, I'm gonna get vlogging Caitlin to take it away from now on. Location one we have chosen, this is a courtyard with like a little mini gym, some cones, a square like football goal and we're gonna take our interpretations, try and make something cool out of this location, number one. So this was the final image which I liked the best. We went for this side leaning on the wall kind of style with my foot on the cone. So whilst we were in that location there was also these like treadmill outdoor exercise machines. So we took some photos on those as well but personally they're not my favourite. But I'm still going to show you of all of them the one that kind of made it work. Kind of. Okay, for number two, I went for this one, thought it was quite cool how I was staring into the distance and all like the pastel. Next location, we went to another courtyard. Basically, we were just walking around this like housing estate in London. It was like a little bit run down, but there were some really cool edgy areas which we found and one of them was this blue courtyard, the walls were blue, the tarmac was blue, the railings were all blue, so we thought we'd try and make it work, even though it was quite overwhelming, blue. Is this blue courtyard here, we're trying to interpret it different ways, and Karis is getting her photos done at the moment, so I've already done mine, I'll show you guys on top of that, but yes. Location two is this blue courtyard area with all these people watching us. For 
this one. I was not really keen on this location. I thought the blue was way too much, but this one was my favorite, just kind of chilling on the blue concrete. So location number four, we went to Lidl. We were gonna go inside Lidl because, you know, in all these other videos that you see YouTubers do, they go inside department stores and try and take a cool photo in front of the fridges or the milk or, you know, whatever. But we got to Lidl, it was closed. So instead, we tried to make the car park work. So this is at the car park. Okay, it's bright. So location two, actually, I don't know what location we're on number actually. We've changed outfits, this is outfit number two, location like three or something. We're currently gonna do outside Lidl and then we're gonna do inside Lidl. Lidl's here. I say. Oh yeah. <laughs> Holding on for dear life. So I really really like this photo, I think it's pretty sassy. I like how my top is lined and it goes with the bars and also the yellow and black. Location number five was in this like housing estate area and it was on the stairway leading up to the top kind of balcony area of some flats. So outfit number three, location number whatever we're on, five, six, I don't know, is on this kind of like staircase. So James is there taking photos. I've done one kind of on the stairs and then Karis is down here. Interesting. What happened? This one I like how cute and fun it is compared to all the other ones which have been super serious and I just think it's really cool a different perspective of the camera going downwards and me looking up the way was when we were walking from one location to the other we came across this like building site sign you know like holding up a sign I don't know some construction stuff basically and we tried to make it work so we're gonna try to get something cool with this as well, it may or may not work, but we're gonna try this interesting. What are you gonna do? Rose sign. In my world of magic, accidentally tragic, it should never happen. We never let it go. Let's we skipping So this one was kind of a bit of fun. We didn't really think that this location would work, but I think it's pretty cool and I wanted to just throw it in there because it was just very spontaneous. The final location which we shot at, I don't know, I think we're number six, I don't know, was this under passage. So you know how when you go underneath roads, if you want to like walk underneath them, you know, kind of like into tube stations and stuff. There's those, I don't know, you'll see it in the video. But basically we went down, we thought it was gonna be super ugly. It ended up to be some funky lights down there, like yellow, green, purple, looked like a mini disco down there. So we messed about, took some photos in there, and I think they turned out pretty cool. Not gonna lie. So still this same outfit, outfit number three, we have come to a different location. We walked down here, which we thought would be like, you know, pretty ugly. We've come down and we found this really cool alleyway, which is actually turning out really cool in photos. So it looks like this. It's got some weird neon lights, but we're making it work, I think, for the photos. So this would be a really, really cool one if this turns out well. Final surrender in decays. All of the features in a stage. Final surrender. Final surrender. This final one, I couldn't decide between two images, so I'm gonna show you them both. I really like this location, how the tunnel is going backwards and I'm in the center of it with like the lights on each side. Okay guys, those were all my photos which I took in the ugly locations. Let me know down below which location you thought was the coolest, like which one was the ugliest. 
and I made work the best. Do you know what I mean? Like, which one was the most surprising? Let me know down in the comments. Also, definitely check out Keris and James as well. Thank you so much to both of them for working on this video with me. It was super fun to shoot with you guys. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a thumbs up and subscribe down there. And I will see you soon in my next video.